With giant Hokuseiho suddenly hobbling, a second audition for Sumo Breakout Star went to high school champion Kitano Waka. Brought to Pro Sumo by Kitano Fuji, whose restaurant lies in his Niigata hometown. Having bunker proofed his already fine frame against colleague Hokuto Fuji in a building Kitano Fuji owns, the youngster was itching for his Division 2 test and sailed through the early questions. Predicting Chiyono O would dive inside. and responding with favoured outside left. <laughs> then a direct attack on a fellow promotee showcased the spearing thrusts he can also unleash. Day 3 was all about the footwork, following the improved charge which checked even big Hakuyozan. Those were all first meetings, but the man who beat him last time did so again here, hitting hard into the left to neutralize, keeping elbow in place until the pull was enforced, clearing the path for a frontal left. Some opponents just love facing his style. One man who doesn't though is Chiyo Arashi. whose only hope lay with a left side scoop that was quickly snuffed, then reached around for the crucial grip with which bouncing knees could be deployed. Which doubtless made the youngster say, I can take Yago. But a high school alumnus knowing him so well cannot be viewed lightly, regardless of knees. The head weaving across to buttress the right and create the angle for this. No outside left allowed. Another Saitama Sakai old boy came next and tried to throw inside left. But the breakage of grip freed Kitanawaka's left for assault on the neck with result like so. Next, the trip he used to end Kyokushuho's career was redeployed here on Inform Tohakuryu for a morale boosting win over a uni star. <laughs> and when his arm block told on another uni star, Kita was 7 and 2 with the divisional lead in his sights. But when novelty and freshness wear off, so too does focus. Uni dropout Nishiki Fuji ramming hard with the head and exerting both clamp and grip right to the edge. His colleague Midori Fuji 
too light to copy, fended off, then swerved while hitting. A lesson in the dangers of going full pelt on a fast moving frame. And this brave attempt to cut inside merited a forceful explanation of why the art of arms inside should be better rehearsed. Nishikigi is one of its finer exponents. To Kita's credit, he shunned the sidestep and respected his master's plea for front foot sumo. Saving pay grade with this relentless gripping assault on a far heavier foe. One of my top three wins since turning pro, he panted afterwards. It was good I could fight my game despite the pressure, as that eighth win was weighing on my mind ever more with each passing day. But by ex Sakai teammate Koto Shoho, when shaping to throw, He was red. Tipped left, right, and left again. While the 2015 amateur champ showed why he should swat up on left blocks, especially with his right so badly breached. It's the salaried newbie's custom to breathe a sigh of relief once the eighth win comes and flag thereafter. The three straight defeats show me I'm not there yet. He did concede. And I should learn from them. Kita is strikingly confident for just 21. And while these two stablemates hold top division ground, he'll know exactly how much he improves.